This morning, Rebecca told us that her husband, John, got nothing for Father's Day. Because he <laughs> couldn't make up his mind, so he got nothing. And you said, I taught him a lesson. <laughs> Stop messing around telling me what you want. And so this morning he called you, what, because some package had shown up in the mail? Oh, yeah. He was really excited because a package showed up in the mail, and he finally thought that he got his gift. And in reality, it was bulbs for my Scentsy Pot. <laughs> <laughs> so obviously it's for me. <laughs> but I told him, I said, you hee-hawed, and this is what you get when you hee-haw. What? You said it again. <laughs> where, where are you tonight? Why did you leave me here all alone? I searched the world over and thought I'd found true love. You met another and poof, you was gone. <laughs> wow. How do you even know that song? <laughs> Why am I laughing at it? I feel bad that you know that song. <laughs> this right here, this filled with useless knowledge. And I can't get rid of it. Ever since the 70s, that's been in my head. You mentioned hee-haw again, it's going to happen. It's going to be like a flashback. I'll go right to it. Really? Yep. We'll start talking about Minnie Pearl and the price tag on her yeah, hat. Yeah, see, that's what I think about I when, I, when I say hee-haw. Oh. So I try to say it on a daily basis. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Make it stop. <laughs> All right, that's good. All right.